We're going to be covering how to add an item to the menu UI, and we're going to do it within an object type format. So this is going to allow us to add items and then execute Google Apps Script functions just by clicking and running the functions. And all of these are doing the same thing where they're just popping up this toast here in the bottom right hand corner with the message. So on open, adding it to the trigger, whenever the spreadsheet opens, it's gonna update the UI and adding to the menu an item with the label of extended. And then within there, the menu is gonna have a collection of items here, those are object formatted, where they've got the name and the function that's associated. So whenever that button gets clicked, it's gonna run the corresponding functions. So that's what we're gonna be setting up in this lesson. This lesson, we're going to be showing you how you can add to the menu UI of a sheet. So going into our Google Drive and create a brand new spreadsheet. So we're going to be using this because this is going to be a bound script to the spreadsheet UI. And we're going to be adding another tab here just next to the help tab within the spreadsheet menu. Menu UI and give it a name. And then under the tools and under extensions, go over to apps script. And this will open up the script editor. And we're gonna update the project name to sheet UI. And then within the function, use the function name on open. So this is a function that automatically runs when the spreadsheet is open and it's used to add a custom menu to the spreadsheet itself. So we can select the sheet, so the spreadsheet object, and selecting the spreadsheet app, we can get whatever the current active spreadsheet is. So whenever the spreadsheet opens, the on open function is gonna get run, and we're gonna select within the SS object, the spreadsheet app, so whatever the I, active spreadsheet is gonna be. With the menu items, so we can set up the menu. And this is an array of items that we wanna add, and the items can be added in as objects. So with a name for the item, and this is expecting a string value, so give it a name of test one. So this is the label that the user is gonna see. And then we also have an object called function name. And this is the function as a string that we want to run. And that's going to be run within our Google Apps script. And you can comma separate out and add as many objects as needed. So I'm going to just add one more. And actually, let's add one more. So we'll add in three there. So what this code will do is this is going to set and add to the UI a menu and we still need to add a label to that menu and it's going to add all of these within the array as the menu items so let's go ahead and add it to the spreadsheet using the add menu option and then whatever we want to label the menu and i'll just call it extended and we'll capitalize that and then it's expecting the parameter, which is going to be the list of options that we want within the menu. So now when we open up the spreadsheet, it will add this to the menu. You can also run the on open separately. And what that will do is that will add to the menu object, but we need to accept permissions first. So the first time you run it, you need to accept permissions in order to be able to interact with that spreadsheet. And it's going to ask you to verify. Uh, so this isn't verified app, and we haven't submitted it to Google yet. It does show that I am the developer of this and that the app is going to run using my Google account that I'm creating this app with. It's going to tell me what permissions. It's going to itemize the app script name, which is Sheet UI, and it's going to match to what we have within the Sheet UI. You can always remove any of the apps permissions that you've provided at the myaccount.google.com forward slash permissions or you can click the link here where it says Google account. And then once you're ready, just hit OK and that will run the script. And what we see now when we go to the spreadsheet is that we've got this menu item which is extended. 
So now by clicking these, it's going to run the scripts. We don't have any functions for test one, test two, or test three. Uh, so let's add in some functions. And it's going to be trying to run these functions. So now that we've added it to the menu, we can run the functions this way. And I'll provide a message using the spreadsheet get active. And we'll have a toast message. So toast is going to provide us this pop-up within the spreadsheet display. And I'll just output the value of test one. And we'll do the same toasts for the other. And so what this will do is this is going to run the toasts, which are going to have the pop-up whenever the function is run. So let's try to run test one. And there's our toast for test one in the bottom right hand corner. Run the second one. There's our toast with test two, bottom right hand corner, and toast with text three in the bottom right hand corner. So essentially we're able to run the functions without having to go over to the Google app script and then run them directly as where we've got their spreadsheet open and having that additional tab within the spreadsheet.